Principal Trophy winner. I probably shouldn't say this, but when I was 12, my very first trick that I built was a magic eraser that helped me to pass a math exam. Sneaky magic. That's not really magic, but it made my life easier, for sure. <laughs> if my teachers see this program, they will kill me. I'm going to be a teacher. I'm finishing my degree, and I'm practicing in a school. Now that I'm on the other side, it's, it's different. I make my own tricks. I prefer doing magic close to the audience. I learned a lot of magic, but I try to make it mine. Pen Teller, this is a classic card trick, but with my own ideas. I hope you enjoy. Please welcome the magic of Dante. Hello, my name is Dante, and I'm going to do a magic trick you have never seen before. It's the trick where two cards hunt the chosen one. Well, you may have seen it, but I don't care, okay? <laughs> Just tell me stop when you won, please. Tell me stop, tell me stop. Okay, it's okay, that. I can see the card. We also need two more cards, the two red kings, okay? So here's one, and here is the other one. What this absolute new trick consists of is the following, okay? I'm going to place one of the kings on top, here, and one of the kings on bottom. And I'm going to lose this card here in the middle, yeah, here. And I clearly saw that it's still there, that it has not been teleported yet. Okay, your card lost, and at the count of three, the two kings hunt your chosen card. One, two, and three. The kings hunt one card and the other than your jack of clubs. Thank you very much. I know. Let's go a little farther, okay? Place the two kings carefully, like that, on the table, carefully, carefully, carefully. No, I know what you are thinking, that I'm hiding something under the two kings, but no, okay? Carefully like that, your card is lost again, okay? And now, with the wave of my hand, between the two kings, appears one card that can be other than your jack of clubs. And that's incredible and totally magical. Oh, I, I know that I'm sneaky and you probably think that I'm still hiding something under the two kings, right? But one thing, let's get rid of these ones and let's take this trick to the next level. If you can see through the kings, there can be nothing behind, right? So, I'm going to place your card here, your jack of clubs, there, and I'm going to place the two kings here in the middle, okay? I'm going to place there. It, it's clear enough, isn't it? There's no cards between those two kings, right? There's no cards. So, I just have to wait. <laughs> and the magic happens. Here appears one card that can't be other than your jack of clubs. Thank you very much. Well, I didn't lie to you when I came here and said that I was going to do a magic trick you had never seen before. So let's try. If I place your jack of clubs here in the middle, okay, your jack of clubs. This is the trick in with two cards here. Without a center, hand the selected one, okay? I'm going to do it very slow. One, two, and three. Here appears one card that can be other than your jack of clubs. Thank you very much. Let's hear it for Dante. Wow, 
Oh, so you're sneaky. You like no. sneaky magic? Yeah, I love sneaky magic. Do you love what's happening with magic in Spain? Yeah, I love all the magicians in Spain. If you want to see good magic, go to Spain. Not to see me, no. You can go to Spain and see very good magicians. Yeah, so what do you like most about performing live? I love the faces of the audience when you do a magic trick and they say, wow, <laughs> how you did that? And you say, magic. Of course. All right. Well, Dante, Penn and Teller look ready to tell us how they think you did your magic. Okay. Boys. Well, Dante, you came out and gave us a, made us a promise that you were going to show us something we'd never seen before, and you absolutely did that. Wow. You did that. Um, Thank you. What I really loved about it is how you actually give away a lot of magic secrets mm -hmm. as you go through it. You give a lecture on how to do this basic trick. Most important, you teach them during that that you're using all normal cards because this is the way you handle them, this is the way you do it. But I keep coming back to the fact that you said you'd show us something we'd never seen before. And I think, and uh, I'm just gonna ask you, this is really yours, right? Yes. You invented this. Yes. That's astonishing. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, there's performance on this, and there's also craftsmanship on this that is just beyond uh, our wildest dreams. It really is something we've never seen before. And uh, Thank you. it really was, was beautifully done. And it was so amazing that um, uh, although we didn't see anything directly fishy, there's only one way this could be done. We think we know what that is, and we think it's because the real method on this is that you're a genius. <laughs> you did an amazing job at much. showing us something we'd never seen, but I don't think you fooled us. I think maybe you know what I mean. So Dante, does Penn understand how you did your trick? Yes, he understands how I did the trick. Uh, oh, it was so good. Thank, thank, thank you, you so, so much. Good. Dante! More magicians for Penn & Teller to watch and a trick for Penn & Teller to perform. Stay close.